Connor from Lightspeed Construction coming to you from the Old Fort area. We're doing a roof inspection. First thing we're going to look at is there is no drip edge underneath here. We have a single share, uh, single layer of shingles. All right, we're going to get up here. There is no drip edge. We're coming through, we have fascia metal. We've got several soft spots and sagging going on right here. We have an issue that could possibly causing a roof leak with the ridge. There is a hole right here. Uh, um, which makes it concave, which makes it to where the water can get in, possibly run down through the ridge vent, possibly run into uh, down the boards to cause water damage. We've got f quite a few spots where it's feeling soft. <clears throat> got some nail pops. going on or it's raising up the shingles some nail pops going on soft spot hole We've got one hole we've got another nail pop right here you can see as it's raising up the shingle we'll come over here this area needs to be reflashed. We have a hole in the roof right here. Definite water getting in. Got a nail sticking out of there. Not sure why that's sticking out. It's not been sealed on this side. So water could possibly get in there. Possible holes coming behind the sealant. So this chimney is going to need to be reflashed. <clears throat> Over here on the lower section, we got some more issues that are very concerning. <clears throat> now, water is definitely being able to get into that area. Somebody took a shingle, and I'm not exactly sure what they were trying to do there. Try, I guess maybe they ran out of some flashing but that would need to be checked. Water can definitely run up in that way. Um, as water runs down, if it's a heavy rain, it can run up under here and possibly pour in under there. The ridge vent is taken all the way to the edge Generally what we do is we drop this back about two feet from the edge so that water can't blow straight into the ridge vent. And we have some more possible concerns right here. With the flashing there is some holes in the sealant that could cause some concern. Gutters definitely need to be cleaned out, but that's not too big of an issue. Once again, no drip edge. We've got fascia metal with no drip edge. Holes in the fascia metal haven't been sealed. We've got some sagging going on. You see quite a few areas where it looks as though nail pops are coming through. Every area and the nail seems to be popping up, it could be an area for concern. We've got stuff raising up on the roof. We've got quite a few saggy areas. I recommend further inspection from the inside to check for uh, 
to check for water damage and to check and make sure that it's not rotten to give uh, more information on the situation. Again, this is William Ponder with Lightspeed Construction coming to you from Old Fort, North Carolina.